Good morning, good afternoon everyone, this is Marcos and today I'm making a gameplay, a long promised gameplay of the game called Prison of War which I've been promising since 2018 and we're just gonna get right into it. I'll put in the CD and then we'll be able to launch it from the PS2. Uh, luckily I didn't get too much support on the on the video when I announced it so I guess it's okay that I'm only gonna do it now I'm not exactly going to call it a let's play because I'm not sure if I'll be able to finish the game it took me a very long time to be able to finish it so I'm just gonna, gonna call it a gameplay series for Prisoner of War and we'll see from there where it goes Oh yeah, Codemasters they were bought by a parent company, I think. Hopefully the audio will be okay. <coughs> yeah, I actually have the original DVD for this game as well. Okay. Let's get right, right into it. 2002 There's a PC version of this game as well, but uh, I prefer, I think uh, I prefer this one because the controls on the PC version are quite tough, I would say I actually put it a little bit down because I think it's a little bit too loud Okay, so I'm not exactly sure if I have any saves on this uh, memory card. Anyway, so oh, that's interesting. Anyway, let's keep keep that away. This and new game. Oh, I actually have three chapters already. Okay, new game. going to see a cutscene. I'm not sure why the three chapters are, are there. It must be because I've already played the game. Which is not something I've wanted. I wanted to play from the beginning. But I guess it'll be fine like this as well. One mile to target. quality by the way it's not exactly 1080p but uh, it's using a video grabber so yeah this flak's getting heavier we'll only be able to make one pass 300 yards 200 yards okay fritz nice big smile now Scene. Hand off, hand off, drop your weapon, America. <laughs> Easy, Hans. Jackets like this don't come cheap. And we'll meet the general. I think, well, not the general, the early. What do you call these? Good afternoon, oh, Commandant. So good of you to drop in. Good to see you crowds haven't lost your famous sense of humor. I think you'll find us agreeable hosts, Captain. So long as you, how do you Americans say, keep your noses out of trouble. Now, we have just three rules in this camp. Oh? Rule one, you attend roll call every morning and evening. If you fail to report as required, or you 
you enter an illegal area at any time, the guards will find you and punish you. Rule 2. You stay clear of the perimeter fence at all times. The guards have orders to shoot prisoners who stray over the line on the ground. And Rule 3? Rule 3, Captain, is that you obey all the rules. I should have guessed. And say I don't like your rules. Oh, I think you will grow to like them, Captain. A day or two of solitary confinement should see to that. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. We saw your plane go down, sir. Are you okay? Well, I don't figure I'll be sitting down again in a while. Say, is a guy named Jade Heeman brought him here? No, sir. Maybe they've already taken him to Stalag Luft. That's where we're all headed eventually. Oh, yeah? Speak for yourself. Look, sir, if you ask me, you'd be best off staying out of trouble for now. Fall in with the other prisoners. Get to know the routine. You might want to drop your kit bag off in Barrack 1. Anyway, gotta see a fellow about some cigarettes. See you later. Barrack 1, huh? Now, where'd that be? Okay, well that was a long cutscene. Move, prisoner, stand! Okay, calm down. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, so we're gonna drop the back in the first barrack where we're located, where our bed is. Your hiding place. This is a safe place to keep items you might find. Oh, I can't even read it fast enough. Uh, when you are near the hiding place, press square. You can save the game at any time when you're at your bunk. Use square when near to it. Okay. Well, let's drop it in. I don't even think you can use the kit back for anything, to be honest. Uh, this is where we'll get to. Uh, you'll see later in the game. And we're gonna save. Oh. Okay. Uh, we'll call this Let's Play. And hopefully the other saves that were there. Um, let's see, save. Curious if uh, actually yeah, that, that should work. Hopefully, save successful. Okay, let's do morning roll or actually afternoon free time. Yeah, so you can skip the time as well in this game. Okay, let's see what's next. Have you even got any objectives right now? I don't place close and personal possessions issued by the guards. Objectives, no current objectives. Okay, let's speak to this guy then. Not exactly the help, is it? But it sure beats some of the dumps the crowds have thrown me and O'Brien in this year. O'Brien's the Irish guy over there. I'm Clancy. Between us, we could probably write the guidebook on German prison camps. Oh, smart one. Say Clancy, was it? You know how I... Oh, he's, he's gonna read it you know get out of here. <laughs> You're asking the wrong guy. Try going over the wire, under the wire, through the wire. Now, I reckon I'm content just to stare at the wire. You want advice? Try O'Brien. That old fool just won't give up. Uh, how do you know O'Brien? How do you know O'Brien? Me and O'Brien got picked up by the crowds in Italy. Must be over a year ago now. Since then, we've been shipped around so often it feels like we joined the circus. Next stop, Stalag Luft. Looks like the end of the line for us. Uh, why are there only... Oh, she's uh, never mind. Right. Jones, Barkley, Anderson, and Foster were transferred last week. This place is just a temporary holding camp and stop-off point for German supply trucks. I'll speak to you later. Okay. Alright, so, uh, we're gonna speak to the other guy now. Hopefully he'll give us an uh, oh, yeah, mission. Look, Captain, make sure you don't end up like Clancy over there. He used to be a real feisty one, Clancy, but he's been through so many failed escape attempts, the fight's gone right out of him. Oh, that's a shame. I'm not looking to stick around here. Any ideas, O'Brien? That's it, Captain. Never give up. 
As for ideas, well, this might be only a small camp, but security's still pretty tight. But look, if you're serious about giving it a go, I might be able to help you. If you're willing to do me a favor. Oh. I'm listening. You see, there's a little business I need to take care of with one of the guards. I won't go into detail, but the bottom line is I need some currency. I'm sure there's some in sick bay, but my last attempt to reach it got me thrown in the cooler. You want to try? Hell yeah. Maybe. Dollars are right, Marks. Sorry, I should explain. Currency is what we call any contraband we manage to retrieve from the more illegal areas of the camp. You know, chocolate, brandy, cigarettes, that kind of thing. Some things are more valuable than others, of course. Okay. So what's in it for me? Well, if you can get into the city and get me the 50 currency I need, I'll see what I can find to help you get out. What do you say? Yeah, I agree. Okay, I'm in. Right, come and find me when you've got the currency. Oh, and one more thing. Have a word with Clancy. He spent some time in the sick bay not so long ago. I'll speak to you later. Okay, let's see what... Oh, there, he's right there. What can I do for you, Captain? Uh, <laughs> already his first question is how did I get out of there? Clancy, was it? You know how I could get out of here? <laughs> You're asking the wrong. Oh, never mind. He, he, we already spoke about that. Is it true you spent some time in in the sick bay? Is it true you spent some time in the sick bay? Yeah, sprained my ankle a while back. It's behind the mess hall, down in the southeast corner of the camp. Is it easy to get to? No, that's how I busted my ankle. There's a wall all the way around it, and they keep the gate locked. I managed to slip past the tower to avoid the guards, but I slipped off the wall and wound up getting stretchered in. Not quite how I planned it, but what the heck. Yeah. I'll speak to you later. Okay, so we'll have to get the... Actually, we'll have to skip the time first, and then we'll get the 50 currency. Let's see if it's anywhere else on the map, because I don't exactly remember. I wonder if the... Uh, the bark is any different from oh yeah it is a little bit different from the first one okay uh, I think I'll I want to save or actually let's take a look at over there okay there's no currency here yeah I'm pretty sure uh, okay uh, let's save it first and then uh, we'll skip the time. Actually, you skip the time by saving the game in the first place. <coughs> it's been uh, quite a while since I last played this, but I still remember some of it. Okay, morning roll we'll call. That's how we'll be able to get to that area. Second day as a prisoner of war. Good morning, gentlemen. I am delighted to see you all so eager to face the day. Dismissed! Okay. Is there any currency as well? Or Never mind, there's no. That's in the later levels, I think. And this is where the kitchen is. <laughs> Let's speak to this guy. There's a special treat this evening. I shall prepare my famous sauerkraut. I am expected to work with these meager rations. It's ridiculous. Oh. My brother is not your lucky American. It is the finest of all Germany. Okay, so yeah, the objective is to get the 50 currency and we'll have to wait for this guy to go and then uh, we'll go behind the sick bay. I just realized, uh, actually. Do not obstruct me, or you will be sent to the pool. Okay, calm down. Okay, first we'll get here. <coughs> this is where the game starts to get a little tough. 
you are no longer walk, just walking about, you're actually stealing things and uh, going to areas where you're not supposed to, of course. Okay, so there is the first 10 uh, of the currency, whatever you call it, money. sort of a green paper and make sure to not tip over the bin and then from here uh, there's actually more inside so we'll get yeah 30 from this this is the door closed and we can now run and there we go 50 let's uh, we'll actually come back here later as well get behind the sick bay because if we get in in, uh, in this area over there we could get caught so uh, actually there's a barbed wire there come on yeah there we go okay and I'm not sure where the other guard is if he's over there or I will see I really hope we don't get caught because that would have been oh no he's right there Morning exercise. We'll just wait for this guard to pass and then we'll, we'll go right for it. Okay, let's come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Okay. I don't, I don't think there's anyone in here. <laughs> there's actually a German uniform, but you can't use it in this level. A currency now. I don't think there's anything else in here. There might be a. Oh, yeah, there's a room right there. Where you can switch the. Uh, if you have good polish. Yeah, I don't remember. Do we have to go this way? I think, yeah. Oh, no, no, no. That was not what I've been in a bad area. Go down. Yes, okay, that was, that was close. I'm really surprised he hasn't seen me actually. Anyway. Let's talk to this guy and give him the currency that he needs. I've got your currency. I've got your currency. That's grand. I've, I've got, got something for you too. Let's meet in my barracks later. Okay. Can't have about some guards around, but I thought this might come in handy. Boot polish? I appreciate the sentiment, Sergeant, but I've always been a suede man. No, sir, let's be your face. Help you sneak about at night, see? I'll never actually use this. Make sure you don't miss anywhere. Well, thanks, I guess. I'll stash it in my hiding place for now. There's one more thing, sir. I bribed one of the guards with that currency you gave me. Oh. He'll slip me anything Jerry confiscates from the prisoners. So, if you happen to have a run in with the guards, come and find me, and I'll see what I can do. I'll do that, Sergeant. You sleep well now. So you can actually bribe the uh, German. Uh, anyway, let's see. Good morning, gentlemen. I am delighted to see you all so eager to face the day. This. Hey, hands off, Wolfgang! Didn't they teach you any manners in kindergarten? Watch where you're treading those jack boots. Yeah, he really does have some humor. <laughs> hey, buddy! I was beginning to figure they plowed you into the fatherland. Not me. I managed to give the search party a slip. But then... Well, did you get a load of local dames? JD, don't tell me. Let's just say I decided to lay low for a while. But it turns out this foreign line's pop is a big shot general around here. Doesn't take, take too kindly to my line of international relations. <laughs> Next thing I know, the goon squad shows up. Say, you planning on sticking around here? Nope. You? Nope. And I'll tell you what. They brought me in here the long way around, and it looks like part of this camp's a truck compound. 
some kind of long haul stop off point. Oh, yeah? I figure if we could stow away in one of those trucks, we could be home for Christmas. Sorry to butt in, but I couldn't help overhearing. You're not the first prisoners to take an interest in those trucks, and the crowds know it. They've made sure the only way into that compound is through the driver's quarters, and they keep the door to that padlocked. Crowbar? Crowbar. You'll be lucky. The guards keep all their tools locked in the store in the northwest of the camp. Then all we need is the key to the store. What are the chances we'll find one lying around the crowd's bearers? These are German guards we're talking about. Okay, here's the deal. I'll distract the guards during morning exercise while you sneak in and look for a key. Just let me know when you're ready to move. J.D., I always said we made a beautiful tea. <coughs> Excuse me once again, I'm sorry for coughing. Uh, okay, so find the brass key, break into the German barracks and steal the brass key. There we, yeah, let's repeat it. Uh, let your co pilot J.D. know when the key is in your possession. Okay, so... Uh, yeah, I know what actually we might not even need to save because I'm this is just a simple task. It's in the same area where we, we've already been. Uh, yeah, okay. We can't actually pick up the stones here, that might only be available in the later levels. After this, we'll, we will save though because uh, I don't want to risk. The next uh, mission is going to be much harder. I think uh, maybe only two more missions and then we'll be out of this prison. I think. What, we, what I'll do is uh, uh, when, we, when it does save there, after the cutscene, uh, I'll stop the first part of this game and then uh, continue to the next part and record that. Okay, breakfast. So, I hope they're still there in this area. Oh, there they are. Okay. So he's going to be eating with them right now. And there we go. These guards don't look so smart. Let me know when you're ready to sniff around the barracks and I'll make sure they're looking the other way. Morning exercise has to be the best time. Uh, okay. He's ours. Nice going. I'll come find you after the lights out. So we can get into that tool store now. But sneaking past the guards can be tough. Tough, yes. Impossible? No. No? In fact, your good buddy JD did a dry run earlier, and I'll tell you how. <laughs> I'm all ears. Looks like at some point a truck hit the surrounding wall, and the crowds haven't gotten around to patching up the hole. That's where you got through? Sure did. Had to crouch down a little and keep an eye on the guard tower. Any patrols? Two. But they tend to stop off for a chat each time they meet, so I slip past them. Simple as that. Almost. There's one other guy patrolling around the store. Had to duck behind some logs to avoid that fellow. JD, you're good, but I'm better. Bet I can do it in half the time. <coughs> okay, we'll stay right there. And yeah, alright. said morning roll is the best time. Well, I hope actually. Oh 
Okay. I would have probably actually, I should have probably done it in the night drawer, but uh, yeah. Good morning, gentlemen. Okay, we know these uh, words that, that he says now, so we'll just yeah, we'll just skip and then. Okay, I'm actually gonna attempt to go right now. Oh no, did I not get the brass key? Is it still in my uh, in my inventory? Oh, yeah, we have to go back. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I completely forgot to. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, Jesus. Oh, I think we'll have to repeat this. Wait, button. So now it says, "Oh, pocket ob objects." Okay, open any door with a brass. It's not the okay objective. Still the crowbar, this is gonna be a bit tough, I think. <coughs> Please, I hope I'll be able to do this. Yeah, this is not looking good. Okay. I, I really should have done this in the night rather than doing it in the day. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Okay, run, 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 run. Come on. He was getting stuck and stuff. Than this in the day, I, I did. Oh no, <laughs> this is gonna be. I've never done this in the uh, day before, so okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, it's not too far from the barracks but uh, it's still a little bit tough now uh, the thing is I have no idea when uh, when this uh, this is a bit difficult if you go a little bit to the left okay, oh, he's looking out he's looking out okay come on come on come on come on come on come on Ooh. I really, really hope I'll pass this. Oh, I'm really scared. Damn, come on, stop getting stuck. Oh my god. Oh. I really get angry easily. I hate when in games you get stuck and stuff. Just in case, come on. Oh, is he gonna turn over here? No. Come on. Turn. Whew. Oh, we might have actually been able to do this, but uh. The thing is, I don't know if... Okay, we got it. Now, I don't even know if I can save here, that's a problem. Oh, no. No, you're joking. Oh, ha, 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 ha. this is gonna be so difficult. So difficult. I thought I would be just able to save. Apparently, I haven't played this game in a really big while, actually. 
How the hell are we gonna get over there? guard like right there a bad feeling oh no he's right there are you kidding me how the hell are we gonna get over there oh okay we actually just did it pretty much because the door opened so we're lucky save here let's play over right and I think I'll uh, finish the recording here because I don't want it to get any any longer than that for the first part okay so thank you for watching the first part and uh, I'll see you next time thank you for watching and bye